What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. I'm sure a lot of you guys are thinking, how can AMC really pop off? Because right now the stock seems to really enjoy being at roughly $35. And it has tested the floor value of $33 and $34 four times already. One here, one here, third time right here, and the fourth time, which is what we're at right now. So AMC at roughly 34, 35 bucks. It's not the best thing to have, but at the same time, it is at a place where it's actually pretty stable. It's consolidating and not that much movement. And even when the volume was extremely high, indicating a lot of you know naked shorting, short interest, dark pulls, all this kind of stuff, crazy amount of volume, which is twice as high as the second biggest volume. AMC didn't really go down any further, but it didn't really go back up. So it's consolidating pretty well. And we also have been seeing a ton of shares that are on loan. And a lot of these shares eventually have to be returned. And when they are returned, we could be seeing a massive squeeze to the moon. Before we dive into deeper, make sure you guys check out the private Discord server, guys. Link in the description below. If you guys wanna trade with us, definitely feel free to do so. It's free until August. And by the way, a lot of our calls make a lot of money. For example, the original new egg call that we opened up is now up 400 whopping percent. We also made a Disney call, which made 145%. If you wanna trade with us, get some of the best trades in the house, definitely check it out. It's free until August 1st and spots are limited. All right, let's get back to AMC because some big things are happening and I wanna tell you guys what Ortex has to say. Ortex is also saying that there seems to be a lot of suspicious activity, especially how AMC did trade as low as $31 at one point, and then nine hours later, it bounced up to almost 40 bucks. It's almost a 30% jump, and a lot of this was hedgies pushing the price down, and then they cover on some of the positions, and the price actually shoots up. And during this time, the FTD data was also published and what Ortex is saying that this is an unusually high number of unsettled funds. Now you've also checked out what Ortex has to say. They also said that over 100 million shares are on loan. A lot of short interest and it's wild. And do you guys know what happened in the very beginning of the AMC rally? We all remember this. AMC going from just you know $20 all the way up to about $70. That is a huge jump right there of roughly 200, 300%. And the whole reason why that even happened was 30 million shares was returned. And when 30 million shares got returned, you got this massive price movement that sent the stock all the way up at roughly 200%, maybe 250. So right now AMC is at roughly 35 bucks. And we could easily see AMC go to $110 if maybe a few million shares get returned. Because just like before, we got millions and millions of shares on loan, and afterwards, a lot of shares got returned, and that caused a massive short squeeze that made a lot of people rich, and even some apes into multi-millionaires. And what I'm seeing here right now is we are seeing AMC doing a really, really fine job of consolidating. And we could be seeing a lot of shares being returned. When a lot of shares being returned, that will trigger perhaps some margin calls on some smaller hedge funds, naked shorts will be forced to close, and also a pretty massive short squeeze that will send the price of AMC all the way to $110. That is my price prediction. Now, when is this gonna happen? Now, this is the most difficult part because right now I feel like the hedgies and most of the market makers have already used up all of their cards because if they could keep using the same strategy strategies over and over again, we would not be having this consolidation of AMC. For essentially the past two trading days, AMC actually stayed pretty well at this area. And that's pretty impressive. And even Friday, AMC refused to go down any further, even though it was a pretty red day. And you clearly see this high volume and what's going on. And nevertheless though, AMC is still an extremely popular stock. If you check out Fidelity, for example, the buy orders still outnumber the sell orders. And sometimes it outnumbers it by a beautiful two to one ratio. And that's something you don't really see before. But nevertheless, so I do have a pretty good short-term price prediction. And remember, when there's an actual really, really big squeeze of AMC going up, it's a sudden price movement. It will actually double or even triple your portfolio within just a couple of days. It's a really sudden movement and you can't really time this. We don't know the exact date of this. But just remember that over 100 million shares are on loan. 
more specifically 101 million shares are on loan and last time when 20 dollars became 70 bucks of amc that was only 30 million shares being returned and that caused a whole heck of a lot of trading and right now let's just see where amc is headed to one big thing that AMC has to maintain during this period is having a lot of retail interest. Because if retail interest gets bored, if retail interest dies off and everyone starts, you know, putting their money in Apple, going away, messing around with other stocks and stuff like that, and everyone keeps leaving AMC, AMC is completely screwed. The whole reason why AMC is such a big deal and such a pretty amazing stock is it's actually a stock that's owned by the retail traders. And that, in my opinion, is extremely important. Before we go any further, a word from our sponsor, definitely check out Moomoo, link in the description below. Click on it, make a Moomoo account, deposit some money and get up to two free stocks. And why not check it out? If you could deposit 5,000, two more free stocks. And a lot of times the stock that they give you guys are actually pretty good. I got two Wells Fargo stocks, which are worth like 40 bucks each. And that is pretty nice. If you guys want some free money, hey, why not check it out? Okay, let's get right back into AMC because we are seeing a ton of retail interest here. And I know some of you guys have heard of this ache festival that's going on. It's in the Paris Hotel in Las Vegas. Pretty fancy. Three day pass, 150. You could go to 250, 600 bucks, or even $1,000. And we do have some pretty popular influencers out there, even some VIP sections. Now, I know a lot of you guys simply do not like this idea. Now, some of you guys might love this idea. Some people feel like this is just a complete waste of money. Some people feel like this is a really awesome event to socialize and meet other apes. In my opinion, this is a pretty good event just to keep on with the retail interest. Because like I said before, if retail interest dies down, if it just slowly dissolves, that will no longer be fun. This is why in Fidelity for like two weeks straight, AMC is still ranked the number one stock. It's still number one. And number two, number three is always a different stock every single day. AMC essentially has been number one or occasionally number two, but usually gets its crown back the next day, virtually every single day for the past three weeks. If you ask me, if the buy orders are constantly bigger than the sell orders, why is the stock going down? It has to be a series of manipulation and also maybe even some naked shorting and crazy volume. And what's also very interesting is the volume is now slowly creeping back up again. And this is a good thing. If we get volume just like before, back around last month, we could be seeing a massive AMC rally right back up. And plus, if you check out some of the technical analysis, AMC has dropped, it has consolidated, and it can't go down any further in my opinion. It's already at this point where it could definitely slowly start exploding upwards because it's not just AMC buying in. I know a lot of the apes don't like the hedge funds, but remember, a lot of these fund managers are going to AMC as well. And we even have a benchmark beating robot. Remember, benchmark beating. They're straight up selling stocks like Facebook, Walmart, Adobe and dumping the money to AMC. And this robot thinks AMC will outperform Facebook and GameStop. And AMOM is what it is. It's a AI driven fund. And what they're seeing in this is retail traders actually buying more when the stock is selling off, which is the complete opposite of what a lot of these algorithms want you to do. So that is incredible here. I couldn't believe it when I heard that kind of stuff. So that's what it guys. Thanks for watching, comment below. Once again, make sure to check out the private Discord server guys. A lot of really amazing stuff. And also check out BlockFi. Link in the description below. Click on it. Make a BlockFi account. Deposit some money. And get to $250 worth of Bitcoin. It's pretty sweet. And see you guys later. More AMC videos to come.